Here's how fake lighting can save you during comic coloring. After I rendered the background of this panel and flatted the character, I realized I hadn't planned properly, and the color similarities were making her blend into the wall. There's a big window here, so I obeyed that, adding shadows and a couple layers of highlights, which helped, but it still wasn't enough. So at this point, I just said screw it and added a fake second light source from the other side just to get her to finally pop. It's false, but no reader will ever care.